And we're back with what should be the finale of this game. I do need to turn in some quests. Took care of your goblin problem? Thanks, that should give us enough time to recover. Glad we have service. What's wrong? Is this sure really that much stronger we are? Yep. We're elite knights trained to fight monsters. Your soldiers defend the town. Two very different tasks, if you say so. Everyone needs a little help from time to time. There's nothing wrong with that. You're right. I'll take this as an inspiration to become even stronger. Glad to hear it. Cool. Uh, markets. Here you go! Thank you, this is exactly what I needed. Does that mean you'll be open for prison soon? I said a few days, it's been like three hours. Still be there too, but I'm almost there. I'm glad to hear it. Pretty exciting. After all this time, I'm finally an official licensed enchanter with my own practice. I've dreamed of this day for so long. Did you always want to be an enchanter? Nah, not even close. I want to be a combat mage. Hehe, <laughs> fire! What happened? No affinity for combat magic whatsoever. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Don't know what I would have done if I could fulfill my dream and join the Ashen Order. It's alright, I took it pretty hard at first, but it helped me discover my skills in Enchanter. Do you ever wish it was different? Sometimes, but I can still fulfill my dream, just in a different way. I want to go on adventures, but instead I can help people who do. Those aren't the same at all. Way to shit on her new dream. It both results in helping people, bitch. I guess. Happy with how my life turned out. The future is bright. I'll let you get back to up then. Cool. Docks. Ruby! What? What is it? I have something for you here! I'm missing book, where'd you find it? Did you steal it? Was it those darn lizard people? It was in the forest, someone had buried it there. Yes, lizard people are very good at digging holes. Buried it? Why would they do that? I have no idea! And they didn't want the book for themselves, they just didn't want me to be able to study it anymore either. That sounds logical, but why would they want to do that? Sabotage! Because they're people. What? Someone must be trying to sabotage my research. Why, well, I won't let my guard down now that I know about it. Those darn lizard people. Take your... Give them an inch, they'll take a mile. Why would someone want to sabotage your research? Look into some sense of matters if this reaches the wrong ears. You know, lizard ears. I see. Okay. And this book will help me a lot, though. I'm willing to take the risk for pursuit of knowledge. So this book is directly related to your research? Yeah, didn't I say that? No. It's about the Alcane, isn't it? Not entirely. While one section does deal with what little we know about Alcane civilization, it's really about an unexplained magical phenomenon. You mean like what happens with the artifacts, right? That's one example. Is there more? Oh, yes. Such as... Well, far up north, there's a legend about a ghostly woman who shows up whenever it snows. Yukiana, okay. You can see her drifting through the snow, searching for something, and when the storm clears, the woman's nowhere to be found. Impressed? Is it a collection of ghost stories, or is that just a ghost story? So the untrained ear, yes. But the chapter they have on lizard people matches, so everything else must be true. Um, untrained ear. See, that's just one of many stories from the same area. There are more. Shadowy figures and fallen strange voices overheard during a storm, and of course, the ghostly woman. So many reports that suggest something is happening up there. But it can't be lizard people. They're cold blooded. They won't like it in the cold. Let's see the initial ghost stories send people's imaginations into overdrive, and now anything that happens has some supernatural meaning attached to it. Wow, you're really a spoiler sport, aren't you? No, I've just been taught to carefully analyze any situation, that's all. Huh? Whatever you say, won't bother you with my ghost stories anymore. Ah, don't be like that. Would you just discount the other stories the same way? Wait, are they all like that? Did I go through trouble taking that thing off and it's just a collection of spooky stories? Oh no, it covers many types of phenomena. That makes me feel a little better. Strange curses know it's been able to explain mysterious weapons infused with magic know it can replicate cursed locations bound by unknown magic. You know, the secret society of lizard people that live beneath our feet and of course the okay. See, this sort of thing I'm interested in. Can you read my paper? What? Once I include my research, publish a paper on it all, you'll read it? Sure, I guess. Going for a better get to work then. I've got books to read before I give writing. Well, good luck with that. Thanks then for all your help. Anytime. Always a pleasure, Catherine. Here. Ah, what is that horse that's trying to kill me, man? Kiss my I mean I've known around fish all the time and I haven't bathed in weeks, but man, man, what you wish you get her.
This year, Stonefish, I thought you wanted to return to you. Although, it's sat on sun for an unfortunate amount of time. What am I supposed to do now with my fish, man? I mean, I know that fish in there normally in the sun all day because you know, there's no such thing as shade underwater, but man, because man, fish. I don't know if I have to take care of the thieves. You shouldn't have any more trouble. Oh. Why are you still here, man? What is that? Well, like I brought you food or money or something. I brought back your fish just like you wanted. That's a very result. I don't think that. Do I know that? Do I know the more fish? I don't give me like nothing. Alright. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, uh, is that everything? Is that all my quests? There's, there's the ship. I have to go back to Sir Zack and report what happened. I wish I could avoid, but the longer away, the farther away the people can. There's no time. What would happen? You have completed the Kickstarter prototype demo for Eternal Radiance. We hope you've enjoyed playing the demo. Okay. So that's the end of the demo for Eternal per uh, Radiance. Interesting. It's fairly... Well done. Uh, let's see. So, points of concern. Uh, let's see. That one combat man with all the goblins could have been about a third of the size. For the first map, it was a bit too large. Like, I'd rather go through three separate maps all a third of the size than one giant map like that. So that's hopefully something that they'll think about and fix later on. Um, there wasn't really a use for jumping. I'm glad it was in there, but not a use for that. And menus could have been... You know, they could look a bit better. I understand, it's a demo, so yeah, menu art is not really the, at the top of their list of concerns. As for the positive things, pretty good. Um, there were a lot of characters, and they were interesting in their own right. They have side quests, and that's always a good start, for, especially for a demo. Uh, the combat, I think I said it, but it could use a little bit of Z-targeting or some auto-correct. Because so many times I would start an attack combo and then hit them once, and they'd fly off to the side, and then the rest of my combo misses. Just a little bit of autocorrect on that would be nice, although that's actually really difficult to do in the Unity engine, so I know why it's not in there. But hopefully in the full release it will have that. Um, the actual combat was interesting. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about, feel about the fact that T is a ranged attack. Some of the key bindings is a bit weird. But combat was still pretty nice. It reminds me of um, our original Kingdom, Kingdom Hearts 1, but with actual better camera controls, which is big thing. Big. Very good. Uh, the story's interesting. I wish we could have learned a bit more on what exactly the artifacts do. Uh, obviously, none of the choices we made in the game actually seem to have an influence. Like, they do affect of probably the immediate conversation you have, but nothing long-term. Hoping in the end, hope, I doubt it, but if they could make it so these conversations have long-term effects, that'd be nice. But again, it's not likely because it doesn't feel like, you know, that type of game. It doesn't feel like a dating sim type game. Uh, I wish Enchanting was in the demo, just like a little base thing to show how it would work, because I don't, while I enjoy enchanting and crafting in games, sometimes it's done poorly, sometimes it's done well. This will have enchanting, but I don't know how it works, so I can't say one way or the other. I hope for, I hope for the best. So this is a good game. Um, there should still be some time to further kickstart it. It is already fully kickstarted, but you can always pay more to support them or get the full version of the game, and maybe they'll put in additional features or your name in the credits or whatever, you know, kick general kickstarter stuff. There will be a link in the description to both the itch.io page and the kickstarter page. Uh, yeah. So, if you like the video, do the thing that does the thing that lets me know about the thing, and until next time... 
Bye-bye.